Hello and welcome to Tropical RV Sales. Today we're doing the virtual tour on this brand new Rockwood. This is the ESP Edition 2280 BH model. The ESP is the Extreme Sports Package and there's a lot of cool features and upgrades on this unit. I'm going to give you the tour and we'll talk about a lot of those as we go. Now this unit, to give you a rundown on the specs, uh, 19.2. That's the exterior length from tongue to bumper. So there's still potential possibly for fitting it into your garage. I know some garages may be 18, that wouldn't work 20 feet. Uh, possibly if you have something bigger than that, shouldn't be an issue, but uh, definitely want to measure uh, if that is critical to you. And it does have the full size uh, spare tire package, so that actually extends beyond that 19 too. Spare tire is removable if you really did need those uh, extra inches to get it in your garage, because that is a cool benefit of the folding camper is that they are compact, they do fold up, and you can keep them in your garage and you know you keep them looking brand new if you can keep them uh, like that and don't have to worry about them out in the element so that is a great benefit uh, the other other one of the well a couple other benefits to the folding camper is the camping feel you just have a super spacious interior but all your uh, bed ends and your windows that you can see there everything unzips to screen so that's something that you lose when you go to the travel trailers this unit weighs 2500 pounds uh, and change uh, you can get into small travel trailers uh, in that weight rating um, but you don't get the spacious interior you don't get the sleeping capacity you don't get the uh, uh, ability to, to fit them in your garage typically they're, they're usually too tall and because they are full profile they don't collapse like this unit does they're much more um, strenuous for the tow vehicle so that's a big benefit to these folding campers is that they, they, they do collapse you don't have all the wind resistance that you have when you're towing a travel trailer. Even if it is a compact, lightweight travel trailer, you still have a large front uh, frontal surface area and you do have a lot more resistance on the tow vehicle. So some uh, tow vehicles may be rated for a particular weight and they may uh, disallow uh, travel trailers um, you know, if you read the manual because of that frontal surface area and the resistance it creates. So these fold down, uh, you don't have all that wind resistance um, that you do on a travel trailer. So they are lightweight, they are compact, but the, the fact that they, they drop down for towing, that makes them much more efficient. And even if you can tow a much larger unit, these are much more efficient, again, because you don't have that resistance on your vehicle so even if you're towing this with a full-size pickup truck again it's just going to be that much easier to tow and much more efficient you're going to save on fuel especially uh, on the highway that's when the travel trailers really take the biggest toll on your efficiency uh, but again the camping fuel is something a lot of people go for um, and, and a reason a lot of people go for the folding campers instead of the travel trailers it just everything ends up the screen you just have a really cool feel that you lose in the trailer so a lot of benefits of the folding campers here now this unit in particular has some really cool features again the extreme sports package it's got the 15 inch uh, mud tires mud rover tires i think they're called with the upgraded aluminum wheels it's got a digital uh, Bluetooth stereo receiver. It's got inside speakers. It's got the outside speaker. It's got this track here for your outside uh, gas cooker. This one has a double step entry because it does have the lift kit with the bigger wheels and tires. And then it's got this really nice flip out grab handle, amber porch light. We can't see it here, but well, actually you can see it. It's got the cool LED strip that goes under the awning. So that's the factory installed uh, awning patio awning comes out about seven feet from the unit clips back on the on the sides of the unit this unit does have the factory installed roof ac to upgrade a low profile unit it's got a high flow fan on um, the back left corner there and then it's got the uh, roof uh, rack system uh, factory installed also and this is a really cool storage feature on this unit uh, it's about a two foot deck i think it's maybe about 28 inches uh, but it's an open cargo deck so it gives you a lot of possibilities with carrying extra gear in addition to the uh, roof rack system and looking under here we can see we have the upgraded plywood bed ends and these bed ends are rated for a thousand pounds a piece so your front bed is rated for a thousand pounds and your back bed is rated for a thousand pounds but a cool uh, construction feature which makes it this unit easier to set up these support poles for your beds actually go in place before you pull the bed out so there's no uh, lifting the weight of the bed you put the poles in and then slide the bed out 
that's uh, uh, one of the keys to making this unit easier to set up with less uh, strain. And the big one here is the factory installed power roof system. So there is no cranking to set this unit up or to break it down. And the cranking would be the most strenuous part of setting up a folding camper. Having the power system takes that out of the equation, makes setup much quicker and that much more enjoyable. Now these bed ends can be removed, but for setup, they're considered permanently installed. You have these nice rain flaps that shed water, but the uh, material is actually uh, attached to the bed at the end here. So when you pull out your bed, your mattress and your bedding is always covered by your canvas. So if you set up and rain, your bedding is not exposed uh, to the elements as it would be if you didn't have that feature. So that's another cool feature that makes setup easier, more efficient. This unit has a hot water package here. So this is an upgraded uh, water, hot water heater there. It runs off of your propane. Also this unit does have uh, dual propane tanks. So it's got two 20 pound tanks on the front. We include a single deep cycle RV marine battery. It's got a box that will hold two. And again, uh, there's a look at your upgraded aluminum wheels. It's got heavy duty crank down stabilizer jacks in all four corners. It's got uh, cable hookup. It also has a detachable uh, 30 amp power cord system. This is the fill for your fresh water uh, tank. It is an under floor, I believe it's a 25 gallon fresh water tank. This is the exhaust for your furnace. And this is a hot and cold outdoor spray port. You can shower outdoors with hot and cold water. You can wash off with hot and cold water. And again, the furnace is another upgraded feature. So you have a refrigerator, you have AC, you have hot water, you have a furnace. Uh, and even more stuff we'll talk about when we go inside. Outside lighting, upgraded LED, really sharp uh, exterior with a lot of uh, black accents and diamond plate, blacked out diamond plate. Really nice looking unit inside and outside. And it does have the uh, port on the front for a uh, solar, portable solar panel. So it's prepped for that. Inside we have the slate wood interior, the really nice wood look floor, easy sweep out, wipe down, flooring. Same thing with the uh, furniture. This is like a synthetic leather look and easy to wipe down. And great floor plan here. So I'm in the front looking towards the rear. And basically what we have is uh, a bed that's approximately like a king on the front and a queen on the rear. And then you have a really nice, what I would call full length sofa. And, and dinette. So the dinette folds down for extra sleeping and that folds down for extra sleeping. And you have an aisle here, which is nice when they're up that you can get to your bed without crawling over. If you need extra sleeping, you can fold that down. I think you still have a little bit of space there to get by. But you know, one adult, maybe two kids, additional here. Same thing over here, one adult, maybe two kids. Uh, depends on the size, maybe two adults, uh, depending. But you know, definitely two on the rear bed, two adults on the rear bed, two adults on the front bed. So you have potentially two, four, six, eight person sleeping capacity depending on whether or not you're sleeping kids or adults. So a great floor plan, it's got the, basically the max seating and the max sleeping you're typically gonna find in a folding camper. And uh, a much larger, uh, com much more accommodating than, than again, a, a smaller travel trailer typically. So there's your rooftop AC. LED interior lighting, it's got a laminated foam insulated roof with a metal interior, and then it's got a high flow uh, fan, so that's great. Like I said, everything unzips the screen, so you can take your windows down the screen, then you can take your bed ends down the screen, you get a really nice breeze flowing through here typically, and you can open, uh, turn your, your fan on, and that really pulls air through even more. So that's the feel, this, this openness, and kind of the outdoors feel you, you get inside in comfort. If you're a tent camper, I think you're gonna love the folding camper because you, you get the feel with the comforts. You get the AC at night, you get up off the ground, you have really nice seating. So you have a lot more comforts, um, but you still get that cool camping feel that you tend to lose when you go to a travel trailer. And here we have the uh, kitchen. We have the sink built in, hot and cold because this has the hot uh, water package. We have the gas cooker here which is for indoor. We do have a separate outside cooker on this. That's your fur furnace for heat. So that is a gas furnace controlled by a thermostat on the interior here. Uh, that's your fridge, three-way operation, gas, electric, or 12 volt. We have a push button operation for the water heater. We have power outlets where you need them. We have full extension wood drawers. 
and I'm just kind of pointing these out, but these are all upgraded features that you don't typically find on folding campers. And what Rockwood does is they take a lot of their upgrades from their travel trailers and they incorporate them on their folding campers and they really give you a product that has a ton more features, a ton more value than what other manufacturers are offering. Um, just the way they're set up in production with all their, their brands and their lines, they can do it where other manufacturers can't. Uh, and they can give you a better quality product for more features for the same, if not less money. And this one is uh, pre-wired for solar package. It does have the portable uh, solar port on the front. This is different. This is for a, uh, basically a hardwired or, or a permanent system. It's got the USB ports there on the side of the, the dinette. A little flip down cup holder there. So just a ton of features on this unit. There's your stereo, Bluetooth stereo. It's got the Wi-Fi Ranger on the roof too. Is it the Wi-Fi signal booster? So just a really sharp unit, great floor plan, tons of upgrades and features that make it uh, much more enjoyable to use, much easier to set up and break down than Capini products. And uh, come on in, take a look at this unit in person, Tropical RV Sales, US1 Fort Pierce, tropicalrvsales.com. Uh, thanks for watching. Have a great day.